Yikes. Now, is it just me or is everything these days either the best or the worst or the most? Why have we suddenly become a nation of exaggerators? Well, Jenna Wolf is here to totally undersell her story. Undersell. Totally. Uh -huh. Undersell totally. Okay, I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> because this story about our need to constantly, creatively embellish anything and everything is going to be the greatest story in the history of the entire universe and also totally awesome. It's one of the worst allergy seasons in decades. The year 2010, the worst allergy season in decades. This is the worst allergy season ever. I mean, 2011, the worst allergy season in a century. Could be one of the worst allergy seasons on record. Okay, fine. 2012, the worst allergy season in the history of the world. <laughs> so were any of these seriously the worst? Or have we just become a nation of exaggerators? I have the worst knees in the history of the world. The worst chat we've ever had. This is the worst day ever. All right, Hoda, that might not have been the worst day ever, but that was possibly the worst montage. So where did all this exaggerating come from? I blame Donald Trump for this. Why? Because Donald Trump was like the guy who's just like, it's going to be the biggest, the best, the most fantastic show. You, It's super, it's terrific, and you're great in it. I'm not even in the show. What are you talking about? Maybe we should go to one of the world's yes, foremost fast, exaggeration so. experts. Yes. It's better to be fast, to not be bitten by a werewolf, and then you'll be turned into one, and you'll have to stay in, and then you'll have to get shaved because you'll be too hot, and then you're like... Which means I wish I was back to a human. What? That's right. I sat down to an exclusive world premiere interview with Diana Zorick, the star of those AT&T commercials. When did you first realize that you were an exaggerator? Yesterday. Okay. So this is all kind of just coming together. What we really needed to do was hone in on young Diana's technique. Do you have any superpowers? Yeah. Super earrings? That helped me super hear. Okay. Like, they are ears, so I have double, quadruple ear, ears, because my earrings are ears that actually work. Okay, that's, that's a lot of hearing. Like, if you were going to give me some tips on how I can exaggerate a little bit like you, what would you tell me? Like, if someone asked you, how much do you love someone? And you would say, if someone did ask you, see so much and big as the world. With, like, the Empire State Building, that's how big as the world. Whoa! It's a lot of love. Lesson learned. Turns out there is one thing you can never exaggerate too much. Love. Let Hi, Ted. Hi, Ted. Let's just exaggerate and make it high one million. Get it? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> Uh, wasn't that so unbelievably cute. good oh, and unbelievably funny? But it's in the Tell history us. of the yes. Today Show. Ever. Any I'm telling you. You set the bar. Yeah, I really set the so bar super high. high. And plus, yeah. by the way, it just shows you're going to be a good mom. That's what I took away from that yeah. piece. Yeah, you're yeah but you with can her. talk in that language. Uh -huh. My child is going to be the greatest child uh -oh. in the history. I'll be kicked off every playground on the Upper West Side. It'll be perfect. <laughs> All right, Jenna, thank you so much.